Hey everyone, welcome back to Dan's How To Videos. Today we are continuing the Windows 8 series with a very simple video on how to shut down Windows 8. Let's get started. Shutting down, restarting, putting to sleep, etc. on Windows 8 is a little bit more difficult than it was in the past with previous versions of Windows. And that's mainly because we've lost the start menu that we've all become accustomed to. Now on the bottom left of my computer, you see I have a start menu there and that's because I've programmed one in. Now I've put a link in the description if you wanna grab a start menu or install a start menu on your computer, you can do so. There's a full tutorial video on that. Anyway, I suggest you guys watch this video right till the end because there's a bunch of different ways you can shut down Windows 8 um, using the standard methods that they've provided. Anyway, the first way obviously is going to be using the charms bar here and this is probably what most people do. You go to the charms bar and go to settings, go down to power and simply click it and you'll see it says sleep, shut down and mine says update and restart. Yours will probably just say restart. That's because I have an update pending. Now another way to shut down your computer is to hold the Windows key on your keyboard and press the letter I. This brings up your settings category here and again you would go to power and you'll have the sleep, shut down and restart section. Now a third way to shut down your computer involves going into your control panel and changing the settings. Now an easy way to get to the control panel is to go to the charms bar here, click search and type in control. As soon as you see control panel on the left side just go ahead and click that. Now from this page here you want to go to hardware and sound and then where it says power options you want to click the link that says change what the power buttons do. When this is open you'll see that you have two sections here when I press the power button and when I close the lid. Now if you go to these two sections here you can bring down a drop down menu which allows you to shut down, hibernate, sleep or do nothing to the computer. Now by default mine is set to sleep when I press the power button but you can change this to shut down and it'll be a really quick way for you to shut down your computer. Now the fourth method to shutting down Windows 8 is my personal favorite and again it's going to involve two keys on your keyboard. Now from your desktop screen here you want to hold the alt key and then press F4. That's going to bring up this box right here which is going to allow you to switch the user, sign out, sleep, shut down, or restart your computer. Now again, one of the more popular ways to shut down Windows 8 is to go to your start menu here, your start screen, and you want to click on your profile and you want to sign out. Once you've signed out of your account, at the bottom right you'll see a power icon. If you click that, you'll be able to put your computer to sleep, shut it down, or restart it. All right, so those were the five traditional methods to shutting down or restarting Windows 8. And if you want to grab the start menu once again, the link is in the description with the tutorial on how to do so. It'll bring back some of the old settings that we had with Windows 7 and previous versions, as well as a shutdown bar here, which is just quicker and easier to shut down your computer. And personally, I don't know why Windows didn't at least accompany Windows 8 with an easily accessible shutdown bar here, especially in the charms bar where you've got this tons of space at the top and at the bottom they could have easily put that little power icon there but anyway guys if you want to be notified when I post a new video subscribe up top it's free to do so I post videos Monday through Friday also if you like this video hit the thumbs up button it helps me out a lot as well as leave a comment down below if you have any questions or concerns or comments I'm happy to help anyway thanks for watching I will see you in the next one